Oh wait, hold on. I need you guys to push. Yeah, that works. That works. That works. That works. <laughs> I'm sorry, you guys. This is it. this is perfect. <laughs> See, I got camera and I got people helping me all tonight. I am so excited. Okay, that works. This is Nisi P of Hollywood Connections, VH2 TV Network. We are here at the Sunshine City Film Festival on the red carpet, and I am here with Mr. Marco Polo. Did I get that right? Solo. Solo. See, I told you, this guy is amazing. I saw his movie yesterday. It was so did much like fun. It? Yes, I did. I it was awesome. I couldn't make it, but how, how okay. was it? Was it good? Yeah, it, it was really, really good. Yeah. It, it kept you thinking. Engaged, right? Yeah, yeah, it really did, and I was like, I never want to put anything in my head to make me feel like reality is not what's going on right there. Right, there. Right. Yeah, that was cool. Okay, so how long did it take you to do that movie? Uh, well, it took three to four months. So, really? yeah, I got because I had to grow the hair out. Then I had to. We were doing Asian X at the same time. Right. So, hair haircut, shave. So I postponed. You know, we got to pick some dates. Which one you want to do? So, got to okay. push one or the other back. So, but uh, it was interesting. Uh, so, um, and then. We had to reshoot, and then, you know, because it takes place, there's a lot of before and after scenes, so okay. it was challenging, so okay. yeah, you know. So how long did it take you to do it? I was at three to four months, because, I mean, months. we didn't do it consistently for three, four months, okay. because, you know, either Veronica wasn't available or I wasn't available, so, I mean. Okay, so know. how did you come up with her? Because she was just, like, amazing. I love the way she had the little knife. She's a great actress. Uh, we met at an, on another set, um, okay. and Johnny, you know, and Johnny yeah. and, uh, and uh, Edward, yes. they were shooting a film, so I was part of that, and she was the main character on that, so we met there, and then uh, Max, who, sh who, who made uh, our, um, I forget, the, <laughs> the, the Perfect script. World. Okay. Um, he said, you know, he wanted he wanted something like contrasting. We he, he, so we picked we picked her out. So she was she was a good, great actor too. So you know, okay. um, that's how we picked her out. So okay. So yeah. Marco, how did you come up with that concept for that movie? It started off as a Twilight concept. Okay. Um, Max is like, you know, I want to make something. So I got this idea, and I said, hey, I want to do this Twilight thing where. I'm driving, I get knocked out, and I go into this thing where I reflect on my life and what, you know, either things that are missing, you know, okay. or bothers me. So, like, it was kind of personal, and he's like, he took it, but he wanted to make it more science fiction. Okay. So he took that idea and turned it into the perfect world and added more, like, VR kind of thing, because VR is popular right, right now. So he wanted to make it, like, current, something people could relate to, but still kind of reflect on that void you have in your life that you keep thinking about yeah. you know you want to fulfill but you can't so you kind of just fantasize it in your mind so but the VR does that for you in the movie right so yeah and okay that, so that was a good. short film so are you planning to make it the goal is to do like a series oh, get okay. like 10 people story of 10 people you know something but the, the villain is taking advantage of that wow. to reach her goal but she okay. want to use these people you know who who are weak and manipulate them so that's how you know at the end he transforms into something so i don't know if you got that one okay it's, it's not really him okay um so and we want to grow the story out so we're looking for funding so if anybody wants to help you know produce it so okay. we want to turn it into series okay so if you if there are producers out there that are watching this and they want to help you how do they get in touch with you uh hit me up on uh instagram at marco solo official or go to light uh lightmanphoto.com um, but you know if you connect with me uh, I'll, I'll hit you back so if you want to produce something uh, new that people haven't seen um, has a great potential you know uh, a series that we can, uh, that people can relate to and is interesting and engaging at the same time hit me up at Marcus Solo Official on Instagram and we'll take it from there yeah okay so one more thing you know, you know I gotta show up Marco did his own vest and so I thought this was really cute so, so. we got the dogs and the cats and then I made the glasses yeah, Which I'm, aren't done yet, but I'm working on it. We're working on yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. So this was uh, inspired by Freddie Mercury. He loves cats, or he okay. loved cats, you know? Okay. And he died of AIDS, so, but he had the, mostly cats. Right. So I went to Walmart to get the print, so uh, they had a dog and a cat. So I said, let me mix it up, you know? Because okay. some people love dogs, some people love cats. So. so you know you just did an advertisement for Walmart, right? <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah. That but I want to, I I like, I build a brand. It. It's for my brand, you know? Yeah, so I, I'm gonna love it. So I'm going to expand it. I'm, I, don't wanna, I wanna share this experience with others. So okay. it'll, be, it'll be out sometime this year. So I'll try okay. to put it out, see what the people have to say about okay, it. Okay, so know? is it like a unisex vest that women it's and men can wear? Anybody can wear it, you know? You want to? You can relate to cats and dogs, so, well, you know. Well, I have a puppy, so I... I, I got the puppies for you. Yeah, right I, I do puppies. Because if you did all dogs, it'd be... 
it's, it's more interesting, you know? Yeah, but see, you can have two. You can have one for puppies and one you for can. kitties, right? If that's what people want, I'll, I'll make that, you know? Okay, so Here we have it. We're going to get in touch with Marco to have my own. Um, hand sewed. Yes, hand, hand, hand sewed. Vest. Okay, yeah, we're good. All right. <laughs> this has been Nancy P of Hollywood Connections at the Sunshine City Film Festival on the red carpet. Back to you, Dawn.